Located in Claremont, the Raymond Alf Museum of Paleontology at the Webb Schools exhibits Alf's collection of fossils. The museum provides an educational and scientific awareness for the public. My name is Gabriel Santos. I'm the collections manager and a paleontologist here at the Alf Museum. My favorite part actually is that we are the only nationally accredited museum on a high school campus. And with that, it's super cool that my students that I get to work with are high school students. Um, they get to come into our museum and get to learn an appreciation for science. And they get to go at fossil collecting. And I think that shows in our museum because on exhibit are a lot of the fossils that our students found. And that's something super cool. And there's a story behind that. And when a high school student or any kind of student gets to come here and see that a kid like them could do paleontology, um, it creates a connection that other kids can be like, oh, I can be a scientist or, you know, not even that, just like science is awesome because a kid like me is doing it. And, you know, today we really need more science appreciation, not just education, but just appreciation to know that there's a lot of work that goes into science and it can make the world better. Well, I'm William Barbois. I basically work on preparing fossils today. For the most part, I use recycled dental cleaning tools to help clean fossils. And if there's ever cracks in fossils, we have to apply glue so that way it doesn't continue breaking. Very fragile process and like something like this will take like a couple months to get through. And that's one of the easier ones I've been told. Like for bigger ones, it can take years to get through enough rock just to get to one bone. So it's, it's a lot of work and patience, but it's a great payoff. I, I love doing it. My name is Bailey Jorgensen. I work here at the Raymond Alf Museum of Paleontology. And my name is Billy Guerrero, and I also work at the Raymond Alf Museum of Paleontology. And I am assisting with explaining a little bit what's going on on the table and uh, the, just helping facilitate the touch table. Uh, the Raymond Alf Museum of Paleontology is named after Ray Alf, who is a teacher here at the Webb Schools in Claremont, California. And it was started by a teacher who was an avid paleontologist, uh, hobbyist, and he began taking his students that he taught his high school students out in the field. And soon they amassed quite a good collection and the program just continued going and we decided to start a museum. Now we're a world-class museum with a large collection and we're working every day to make it bigger and better. Uh, just a couple months ago we finished renovating our basement area downstairs. We've got some more interactive exhibits that kids, especially young kids, can get involved with. The learning of the museum and that sort of thing. And it was only a couple years ago that we finished renovating this upstairs area that we have here. So if you come to the museum, you'll start along a timeline and you'll be able to start and see fossils in the Precambrian and work your way in a big circle around to modern day fossils and there's dinosaurs and ice age animals and things in between to check out. So uh, National Fossil Day is a day created by the National Park Service to celebrate our nation's fossil heritage. So National Fossil Day is a day we can bring out all of our really cool fossils for um, everybody to see and learn about all the cool fossils that we can find. A lot of people think you have to go to really far off places in the desert to find fossils, but that's not true. Located at 1175 West Baseline Road, the museum is open Monday through Friday from 8 a.m. to 4 p.m. and on Saturdays from 1 to 4 p.m. For $6 admission, the Raymond Alf Museum of Paleontology is a hidden gem of the Inland Empire.